at this light palette. It's kind of messy because I've been playing around with it, but it's so good. Okay, so it comes with two highlighters. One, this is for the light palette, but they have a lot of sheen to it. One's a little more goldy white and one's a bit more pinky. They're so pretty. And then there is two bronzer contour colors. I'll do them on Heather. These guys, these bronzers are amazing. Then there's like a more gray undertone one. Better for Heather's skin tone. Now here's the medium kit and everything's a bit warmer than the light. So it's a bit darker. And then one is a pink tone and they are really really strong like they are amazing highlighters they are so good working on these colors for so long and one is you know more brownie rich one's a cooler tone one's a warmer tone to get the perfect bronze contour Those are the contour and highlighting shades for the medium kit. And I'm super tan right now. I just got a spray tan, but those colors are so good. And bronzer contours. Now here is our highlighters. They have a gorgeous sheen to them. It's like this rose gold, beautiful sheen. And then a bronzy sheen. Really, really pretty. And then our bronzer contours. Again, we have like a really pretty, rich color. And then we have a color, like I think this one would be great for contouring like the nose and cheekbones and this one to warm you up. So we always have a, a cool color and a warm color. So this is the dark, deep dark, the two contours and the two highlighters. So here are the light contours, the medium contours, and the dark, deep, dark contours. And then I'll show you all the highlighters. And so these are the light highlighters, the medium highlighters, and the dark, deep, dark highlighters. How good does that look? And of course, couldn't forget this cute little brush. A new brush and the heads are interchangeable with the last brush so this one's like angled to do contour and this one is so perfect for highlighter being um, put on someone else instead of doing it live and on myself. I'm that was really hard. I'm seriously so obsessed with them. Look at how, how shiny they are. They're so easy to blend. They're, they're not too gray. They're not too orange. They're like the perfect contour color. This is light. This is medium. And this is dark. So gorgeous. Guys, I'm so excited about these KKW Beauty Highlight and Contour Powders. Look how insane they are. This is with flash, but this is dark. This is medium, and this is light, but the light just literally glows, guys. This is insane. Guess who's back, guys? The king himself. Mario using the new Contour Kit. You guys, Mario really helped me 
with this if it wasn't for Mario honestly I don't know what I would do he's such an inspiration to my soul Aww, Kimberly. You know, he really is but I'm so happy to have my king back in town mm -hmm. I'm making some magic today on a secret project I'll give you a little He's such a hog, he's not even letting you guys see a sneak peek. Ooh. This is an awful angle, but I just want you guys to see this pimple here. You're stressing me the fuck out. Okay guys, I get it. I didn't know how to fucking swatch powders at the beginning. I'm learning. <laughs> You're stressing me the fuck out. I was dying at her swatches today, but she's learning okay, how to Okay, I'm that. learning how to swatch. At least the product, at least the back it up. The wait, product really just wait is till good you guys, though. Wait till you get it. You'll be pleasantly surprised. I'm not worried, but thank you. Let me see you swatch. Let me right. see if me, you know how to swatch. Let me show you guys how to swatch. <laughs> Look, watch and learn, Kim. Oh, That's it's a... What? Okay, wait, let me practice. I'm gonna practice. Okay, so I do two fingers at yes. once. Yes. It's like I'm like fingering that? someone. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, and then I go really hard like Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> no you still you still didn't do it you still didn't do it nicely but mine looks quite good yours looks way better can you do a swatch tutorial with me <laughs> okay the two finger thing i'm not like i need to do it more gracefully Ooh, okay don't press too hard maybe. i look like you were pressing really hard okay one two three there you go yes And guys, I see that my fans are totally hating on someone like Jeffree Star for being, you know, honest about my struggle swatches. <laughs> <laughs> but because of his remarks, I'm learning how, like, from the best, like from Mario, like how to swatch properly. So, guys, like, and I see you being so petty, bringing up things in his past where he, you know, was, you know, negative, but he's also apologized for those things. And I get. It's a serious deal if you say like racial things, but I do believe in people changing and people that apologize, I will give them the benefit of the doubt and accept, you know, that people change and move on. And I know better than anyone that I hate when people bring up my past or mistakes that I've made in the past. So let him live. Like I welcome honest, you know, comments about my products and because of it I'm swatching better now so so everyone get off his ass and let's not be so negative we're all in this together there's room for all of us love you Jeffrey and I want to make one last thing clear I do not defend people that are racist and I'm very against it but if someone claims that they have changed. I would love to give them the benefit of the doubt, and I pray to God that they do change for the sake of my children and my friends. And you know, so I want to give them the benefit of the doubt. And I do not support people that are racist, and that's why I so appreciate that he apologized and was really honest about the things that he said in the past. So just enough. Just don't bring it up anymore is all I'm trying to say. People want to forget the negative things they did in the past, and I do too. And after a long day of work, this is what I get to come home to. Yes. I think there's only two pairs of these. His and hers.